This YCN segment is brought to you by M.J. Harrington and Company, jewelers and designers since 1948. The Sports Wrap Player of the Week is brought to you by Top Stitch Embroidery, the best for your team and so much more. With both embroidery and screen printing in-house, our team will make your team look the best they can be. Rebecca Wright had another huge game for Lebanon as the Raiders beat their rivals from Hanover. She led all scorers with 20 points and pulled down seven rebounds. We caught up with her coach Tim Kehoe to hear what he has to say about his sophomore. And we talked with Becky herself to get her take on the win. Becky's worked really hard. I mean, she plays a lot of basketball. She plays AAU, she plays fall AAU. And you know, tonight we utilize her in the post a lot, but she's also a great three-point shooter. And, uh, you know, as a foul shooter, she was 10 for 12 last night. I don't know what she was tonight, but she was pretty good tonight, too. She's a great player. She's a great player that's only a sophomore, and she works hard every day at it, so she's only going to get better. I feel like we were just acting as a team. You know, we worked on the weaknesses that we've been having the past few games, which was getting out rebound and not talking on defense. And I feel like we just came out and talked on defense and rebound as hard as we could, all five of us. And we just all came together. I feel like we all did, to be honest. You know, losing Anna right now, I just feel like all of us stepped up. We all took our our possessions and took it like seriously. Megan and Leah, they stepped up as point guards. You know, they handled pressure really well. Like they both were really strong. Izzy, she's knocking down some shots. Carrie's knocking down some shots. Like we're all doing really good. We're just stepping up. You know, the third quarter didn't come out too great, but I feel like the fourth quarter we just kind of made up for it and we just kept finding each other. And we knew like they're going to keep hacking because they're getting down and you know, it's frustrating. But I feel like if we just kept feeding to the post or even feed to the post and look for outside shots, it was going to be good. It's definitely important. We had a long past few seven days, you know, four games in seven days. It's kind of tough. Haven't had too many practices to work like on our next game. And then we came off of a good win on Goffstown too. Like I feel like we're just finding ourselves and who we are and how we are as a team. Becky also told us what she thinks her team needs to do to continue to be successful going forward. I think we just need to stay together, keep working hard. That's what we're doing best right now. I don't know. I feel like that's all we need. And just take one game at a time and just keep going hard in practices. That's all we got to keep doing.